What's up guys, CodyFire.tv, just bringing you an update how to go from 15.2 uh, Isengard to Cody Jarvis 16.0, so let's get started. This is on a Fire TV with the Fire Starter uh, setup. Excuse me for, or sorry about the shaking is here, I'm doing this on my phone, but you're going to go ahead and click settings first of all, or actually you'll go to... Um, the updates in Firestarter, you'll check for update, and then if it's if an update's available, which it is 16.0, you'll click update to the latest. Since I already did that, we'll go to the next step, and then you'll click on here. You're gonna go to the settings and the app settings, and then you're gonna clear your data, and then you're gonna launch it. So to kind of speed things up, I already went ahead and you know did all this. So the next step is once you launch it pretend this is something else you would go to your uh where is it uh system you're gonna go to system file manager and then you're going to add our source which is right here the Cody http blah 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 codyfirebuilds.com forward slash repo and once you do that you'll go to settings or system add-ons and then you're gonna go install from zip and whatever you name our thing which in this case Cody fire you'll click on it and you'll click OK and to install the wizard this already has been all, all installed so we're just kind of walking through it briefly otherwise you know it'll take kind of a while to demonstrate everything but due to time purposes here it is and um, you'll next go to programs And then um, it'll be in here and then you'll launch this and this is a new one for Jarvis 16.0 this is Cody fire dose which is two in Spanish and then Dalton and then uh, the regular version you click on it install it when it prompts you to unplug your box you'll go ahead and plug your box plug back in and then it'll take you here of course you launch it you wait for the shortcuts to load and then there you have it it's pretty much the new one and uh, you have your movies etc live TV paid options are Dexter and then of course you can do stalker you can just add it here where it says live TV and um, you know pretty much anything else so it's lightweight under 200 megabytes and it's compatible with uh, you know 15.2 and up so but let's know what you think about it uh, like I said it is lightweight Charb is compatible, and if you have any comments, comment down below. Be sure to like our video, subscribe to our channel, and if anything uh, you don't like about it, you know, feel free to comment also, or what would you change? But this is how to add the new Cody Fire Dose 2.0 for Jarvis. Until next time, happy streaming.